Oh wow. And welcome to the Where the fuck were you? Vlog. It's gonna go up on the main channel as well, but I wanted to put this first on the vlog channel since I have nothing up there but you know my old ass videos of me doing stupid shit when I was younger and some personal live they pretty much some recent stuff that happened I'm still rocking the bracelets you know the Yankees and the Ninja Turtles um, yeah let, ex let, let me explain what happened so as soon as I came back from school for most of you know that seen my videos I left school SUNY Herkimer which is a college here in New York State I left then my friend who will not be named let me use his Wi-Fi but he hooked me up with his Wi-Fi, no problem. And that's when I start making a lot of videos. You know, that's when the live action videos started to come out. Start the channel where it gave you new news updates. News updates. Game reviews. A whole bunch of stuff. And then... Like... Just this September, he cut me off. Like, my friend literally didn't cut me off. Like, he said, here's the password, here's the username. Try logging on. It should work. I said to myself, no, I'm not going to use your shite. Because, not, not, not that I don't want to use it, but is that I want... I need to take a, like, a personal break for myself, like, to figure out exactly what am I doing with my life, because for those of you that don't know, I'm also trying to get into competitive Smash Bros, and I know, like, there's, like, a whole bunch of, like, fucking people in my life, specifically my mom, my dad, my parents, well, my parents, family members, friends are telling me you should pursue something more realistic. I mean, come on, dude. You're about to turn 20 in a week. Like, even, like, this video is being recorded the 15th of November. Even though it was supposed to be recorded way back in October so yeah I've been pushing it and another reason for that is because in October no well technically in September my aunt told my mom one of my aunts she's not gonna be named but my aunt wanted to move in into my apartment and my mom and I were cool about it we were cool and we said you know what this can work you know I mean she, they, she said I'm gonna put on the wife I'm gonna put on the internet we're gonna get some cable up in here let's do it let's party I'm like, okay, cool. I bring her her stuff. And I realize she wants to move in with her dog. Yeah, no. For those of you that follow me on social media, you... My Instagram, my Facebook. Well, not Facebook, but mostly Instagram and Snapchat. Saw that. I was walking a fucking dog and I had a countdown for how many days I was going to be free from this dog. 
and I was gonna get paid, so don't. And I got paid, but I also got stiffed out because like the original agreement of what me and my aunt said was four hundred dollars, but she fifth she stiffed me out on fifty bucks, and I'm not gonna complain. I got my pre-order done for Sonic Mania. I got my new phone. This puppy right here. And I couldn't be happier. You know? But. Now you might be saying, what the fuck does a dog and your aunt have to do with your YouTube channel? You could still record offline and then. Find somewhere with free Wi Fi to upload. Yeah. But you see, my aunt was considered to my mom a threat of what? Privacy. Because my aunt really doesn't know how to respect, like, if you have, like, an envelope sealed up like for example if you have an envelope sealed up with your letters of recommendation that you're not supposed to see but your employer is supposed to see she would open that up read them and then shove them back in the same envelope and try to use the cheap little 99 cent tape to seal it up And, yeah, that's been going on lately. And my dad, who, and my mom, who've been having issues, because I'm not going to lie, like, my parents are in the midst of, like, a civil war between each other. Well, it's been going on for the last 20 years but I mean, it's starting to really really tense up now now that I'm an adult well, I've been an adult but now that I hit like 20 I'm about to hit 20 it's like okay you have to choose where you want to stay where you're gonna go this and the other and on top of that, I have my dad, who is, like, forcing me. Well, not forcing, but it's, like, shoving down my throat to give up professional Smash playing. I give up Smash Brothers, go to the school, whatever, in Manhattan, the Art Institute. I don't even know the name of the school. Hold on. I want to get my info straight here because I know he's going to watch this. The New York in Art Institute. The New York Art Institute. Yeah. It's on 218th of 200. 32nd over at West 40th Street. <sighs> like he wants me to do that over competitive smash. But I'm like, can I just find the job? I, mean, I can't go back to school. Like, the thing about him that he doesn't understand. like, if I can go to a trade school. A technical school. That I can do. Like, if I want to join, I don't know. Mall security. I can do that. I can go to school for that. And then within a couple weeks. Hello. You're now guarding. I don't know. Riverside Plaza Mall. Over in Grand Concourse. Or. Who knows. I might get a job at the Palisades. It's a mall in Jersey. But it's closer towards New York. 
I don't know. And my life is right now, like, yeah, like, the last serious video I uploaded was, like, a petition for me. Not a petition, but, like, a statement that I'm going to determine to go back to school, back to Herkimer, because I realized I couldn't, like, I really needed to go back. But as me, like, as I was thinking about it, I was like, nah, let's not do that. And it was only for one reason. I don't have cash to pay off my tuition. And I know most of you are like, well, you're walking around with an iPhone. You have a necklace you're playing around with. You... And your last video had a fucking ring. Fucking Smash Brothers ring and talking about you want to buy a 3DS. So you clearly have cash. I have limited cash that, like, how can I put this? Okay. If I ask my mom for cash, she will look at me laughing. She will die laughing. I asked my dad for cash, he's gonna be like, I don't have any, I have cancer, you know this and I don't have a job. Okay. And I sure as shit can't ask any of my aunts and uncles. Because if I do, they're gonna tell each other, and then they're gonna want me to pay them back, and with interest. Fuck that noise. And... Like... I have, um, like, and I know like, most people are like, the normal solution, oh, just talk to your uncle, your uncles. They could probably find you a job where they work. They can, but the thing with my uncle is, like, one of them in particular, I hate him with a passion. Like, I hate him so much. Like, every time I see him, like, have you ever met that one person, that one person that, no matter, they whatever they say, they like, add a pure you see you get pure rage and angry, and you just want to knock the fuck out of them, just boom, just on the floor, and just curb stomp the shit out of them. Yeah, that's what I am for this uncle. That's what I want to do to this uncle. And, like, it's sad, I know, but he also, like, he, like, he messed up my life, and he messed up my father's life. And I know this is, like, supposed to be a, a personal upload vlog, like, do, what are you gonna do now with the channel? But, like, my, this uncle gets me really pissed. But what I'm planning to do now for the channel is, hopefully, hopefully if everything works out like it's supposed to, find me a job and hook up, like, and like, if I can find me like a good, de like, not great, like straight out, you know what, manager, no, like, I understand that I have to work up my rank get up there but like if I could find me like a job somewhere where I can just work but not like any job where like okay why do you want this like a job that I know I can honestly do my best at because I don't want a job where, let's say I work at a fish market, and I'm like, I, I don't fucking, I, I don't know what that, a goddamn thing about fish, but put me in the middle of a Target, or a GameStop, or a Best Buy, or a Toys R Us, <laughs> ironic since this, to, this is this shirt from Toys R Us, it's cool, yeah, but I would work there like boom, ready up. 
that my mom has a friend at a thrift store. So I want, I, I hope she can hook me up with a job. Or, or if not, then probably become a babysitter. I know babysitting is not that glamorous, but I really have no other set value skills. Like, I could be, like, a real estate agent, but that will require me in a suit. And I'm not trying to waste no more money than I already have. For those of you who don't know, I don't have a suit. I don't have a suit or a tux or anything like that. At most, I have a couple of dress shirts, but not dress shirts you wear to work. I'm talking about dress shirts, shirts you wear to a bachelor party, to a nightclub, to a dorm party. Like, none elegant, but something you wear to like a strip club but yeah what's gonna happen with the channel I'm gonna get a job hopefully get some Wi-Fi right now how I'm uploading is I upload I record today like today's the 15th I record today upload tomorrow when I go to the library so by this time no library closes at six but I'm always there from ten as soon as it opens until it fucking closes so until then I I stay into the library from 10 until 2.30. The reason why I don't stay later, like 3 o'clock, 4, is because that's when all, like, earliest I leave is 1, one thirty, Because I don't want to stick around for, like, the high, like, the bad thing about my local public library that I have is that it's right next to my old high, like, it's near my old high school. Like you have eight high schools in one building, plus a high school literally next door with a middle school attached to it, plus a new high school that opened up literally right down there, and a middle school that's literally across the street. So you have schools all around just and closing in, and a whole bunch of rowdy teenagers. That do nothing but play fucking League of Legends and Minecraft and watch Naruto. Which reminds me, I have to watch the last episode of Naruto. Because I did not see that shit. I heard it was sad. Please, no one in the comments spoil it for me. I swear to God, I will disable the comments. If I see one thing only thing I know it's Naruto versus Sasuke the last fight and it's sad that's all I know and let's see